Hola TV show brought to you by In Health Mutual and presented by Elva Carroll Grove City. Pride Columbus! It's that time of year again, you guys, and I'm here with Carla Rothen, the Executive Director for Stonewall Columbus. She's going to tell us all about Pride, which this year takes place June 19th through 21st, so tell us about that. Thank you so much, and thanks for having me. I always love being on your show. It's always fun, and it's Pride season. So, you know, Pride started in 1981, a long, long time ago, and there were about 75 people that marched for Pride in 1981, and now we have about 400,000 people coming to us on June 19th. 19th, 20th for the festival in March. So we kick off on a Friday. We have bands and entertainment all day long. We have lots of vendors, lots of food, lots of festivities. Uh, we also are going to have a family area this year so you can bring your kids and it's really going to be a great time. Well, it sounds like so much fun. I know we've attended last year and we had a blast. So this year, tell us, what time is it each day? Okay, we start on Friday at 4 o'clock and we go to 11 and there's music all day. And then on Saturday, we kick off at 11 o'clock. The parade will kick off down at Front and Broad Street. So if you want to march, come with us. You can march down there and just join us. Or you can watch from the street. That's a really great time, too, because there's a lot of fun floats, a lot of companies, a lot of organizations a lot of churches marching and so it is a big fun time certainly agree with you there and Ola TV will also be there in the parade this year now also so for people that may not know or may not have been before how much are tickets how do we get them um, is there a price what do we do Sure. Well, we take donations. You know, we're in a public park, so you really can't charge people an admission. We can't rope it off or fence it off, but we really do rely on support. And so we really encourage everybody to buy a dog tag or a wristband online. It shows that you've donated to the event. It's only $10, and it really goes right back to the community center, which is the organization that actually puts on the whole event. You know, Stonewall funds the community center on high, which has programs and services for the gay, lesbian, bisexual, and transgender community here in Central Ohio. Now, last year you had some pretty big names performing. We had Vicki Martinez, Beverly McClellan, we had Liberty Deep Down as well. So tell us about some of the headliners that will be performing this year. Well, Friday night, Billy Gilman and Michelle Shamuel. Billy Gilman, I don't know if you know him, but he is a country western singer and he came out last October. And so it's really important for us to showcase artists who are out. I think it shows our young people that being out is okay life does get better as you get older so if you're being bullied in school and you're having a hard time and you say oh my gosh you know you'll see these artists that are out and having very successful lives and I think that's really important so those two young artists I think are important for that reason Michelle Shamuel was on The Voice she was one of the runners-up but she still has a great career and so I think she's going to be exceptional and then we've got some local bands too I mean that are gonna be really fun Liberty Deep Down is coming back from last year the fact Fabulous Johnson Brothers, Collide is going to be there this year. So I think we've got a good mix of different types of music and different types of artists. And I think that people will really enjoy it. Well, you heard it, Columbus. Be sure to check out the Pride Festival this year, June 19th through 21st. You'll definitely see OLED TV there. And be sure to check out ColumbusPride.org for more information. Thank you, Carla. Thank you. And happy Pride, Columbus. They're looking at me.